What's up guys, Rupdad here, and Goofy, get the hell out of the way. Your massive turtle shell is blocking... Yeah, just go whack that or something. Wax, not whack. Talk today. Anyway, what's up guys, Rupdad here, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts. In the last episode, we made it to Atlantica. My least favorite world in the game. And go figure, it fits with the theme. Most people hate water levels. And apparently it caused the voice crack. But yes, most people hate water levels and take a wild guess what Atlantica is. The wateriest of water levels that will ever water this side of waterdom. Anyway, uh, before I get started here, I do want to apologize. I know my schedule has been pretty, uh, shitty. I guess that's the nicest way I can probably put it, even. Ever since this, well, for the past few weeks, actually. It's just been a combination of numerous things, and... They've just been beyond my control. But I am going to try and get better about it. My New Year's resolution was not to basically fuck my... Upload schedule to hell and back. So I'm going to make an effort to try and stop it, it's just... Life sucks. Let's put it that way, life sucks. That's probably the best explanation for it. Anyway, we learned how to swim in Atlantica in the last episode. We got to meet King Triton. We ran into a bunch of these assholes. I would love to get this clam and show what's inside of it, but if you're not going to let me, go away, please. Oh, great, now I got Search Ghost on me, too. Wonderful. Ugh. Can they just disappear and not come back? I would really appreciate that. I don't know why you're glowing, but that, it creeps me out. Get out of here. Really? Thank you! Good god. Now, thunder this. And what is inside this clam? Treasure chest. A mithril shard. All that... Whatever, let's just go. Sora the dolphin boy. Because that's totally a thing. Anyway, what we needed to go after meeting with King Triton is to have in the end of the sea gorge. And Ariel invites us over to her own grotto. She wants to show us something. Ooh. I wonder. Oh, by the way, uh, take note of this dolphin here. He will become... We can grab on and ride him, but he is not important for right now. He will become important later. But first thing is first, we have to go to Ariel's grotto. So let's go ahead and move this rock out of the way. There's totally points on there we can grab. And in we go. You do have a lot of interesting and neat things. All from the outside world, huh? And of course, Ariel's dream is to see what's out there. The land beyond the sea. Uh, don't worry, Ariel. Sora knows exactly what you're going through. So Ariel suggests looking for the keyhole. Despite what her father says. Yeah, I agree. You're not a little girl, Ariel. Come on, wake up. Eyes up. <laughs> anyway. Oh, great. Sebastian's watching. That's... Never a good thing. Anyway, uh, here in Ariel's Grotto, there is actually a couple of things here we can grab for ourselves, if I can track them down. There are chests here. There's one, as a matter of fact. Now, there's one in particular I really want to grab before I get out of here. Open Sesame Cottage. Not what I'm looking for, but good to know when that that's there. Okay, next one is right up here. 
torn page. That's exactly what I was looking for. So that's two out of the five torn pages from Pooh's book. And I know there's one also in Monstro that I missed. I've mentioned it before. I will go back for that at some point. You think you'd be able to swim up out of here like that, but... Okay, so... Okay, I'm locked on. Where's this other... Oh, that's Flounder. Okay, there's another treasure chest down here. And inside... Mega Potion. Why can't I log on... Why can't I lock onto some of these things when I don't think I really need to? Can I go up, please, maybe? Could have sworn there was, uh... Nah, whatever. There's... I know there's a four treasure chest in here, but I don't think it really contains anything... ...worth needing to track down. So let's go ahead and leave Ariel's Grotto. We have no further purpose here. Oh boy. That's not good. Ha! Those impudent fools will never find the keyhole. But the girl could prove useful. And I've got the heartless <laughs> on my side. Frighten, my old friend. <laughs> Your day is coming. <laughs> Ugh. That sea hag. We'll be dealing with her soon enough. Anyway. Um, our next destination... Um... Oh, we have a new enemy here! This is the sheltering zone! I believe. Yeah, that's it. Sheltering zone. A sheltering zone is basically a giant sea neon that when you deplete its HP and destroy it, it explodes into a bunch of tiny sea neons. It's basically how they protect themselves. They all merge together into one. And I think my priority right now is... Actually, you know what? I know exactly what I'm going to do. Let's kill all of these guys so we can ride the dolphin, because it's going to come in handy now. But we can't ride it if we're in the middle of a battle. So, screwdrivers, I would greatly appreciate if you would go to hell. Thank you. Or wherever the heartless go when they die. The hell? Okay, that's weird and random. I don't know why I can examine this, but... I'm gonna be pulled out. I'm assuming that's something we'll deal with later. So, Mr. Dolphin! Get up there with him, Sora, and let's ride on. Yeah, this is going nowhere. That's worth the effort, though. However, there is another dolphin that we actually can do something with. But to do that, I need to go back to the Undersea Valley. Okay, I... Of course, trying to get back to the Undersea Valley is going to prove quite interesting. Oh, huh, that takes care of the problem right there, so that's what that whirlpool thing was for. Okay. Now, here, there should be another dolphin, uh, floating around. But I believe we are gonna have to get rid of all the Heartless, as, once again. For- you'll have to forgive me. As I've said in the past, I tend to get lost in Atlantic, and it's one of the reasons why I tend to avoid this world. Underwater level, plus difficult to figure out where to go at times, or remember where to go, equals irritating level. Oh, I don't want to go back into the Tranquil Grotto. Okay, so where is it? I know I'm locked onto it. There it is. Hey, Dolphin! Yoo-hoo, Dolphin, come here! I would like to ride you. Come on, Sora, catch up with him. Thank you. So this Dolphin is actually going to take us... into the Calm Depths. 
swim us through. And this is an area we cannot access before because, as I have said, Calm Depths, calm my ass. I know. And I went ahead and screwed that up. Yay me! <sighs> now I have to find the dolphin again. You've got to be kidding me. <sighs> Cutting away. Alright, I'm back. Stupid heartless. Anyway, let's go ahead and use fear on this clan to get what's inside. While I can, Mithril Shard. Alright, now where is the stupid dolphin? Oh, there's a clam in here I didn't get. Again, clam through treasure chests in this world. Mega Ether. Alright. Where is the dolphin? Go me for- oh, there it is. Go me for completely botching the trip. Come here, dolphin. Come here. And here we go again! I'm riding on a dolphin, doing flips and shit. Okay. I really gotta stop referencing, referencing uh, Lonely Island. I've done that enough. That's stupid kingdom. Ah, I mean Final Fantasy X video. Anyway, to the sunken ship we go. And I believe we need to find a way inside the ship for something. I know there's a bunch of treasure chests around here too, so... Hmm... So, there's something interesting about... Yeah, there's a ship. What is that? Only we could reach it. And apparently nothing doing. So I'll just have to leave that be for now then. Okay, so where do we go then? Undersea treasure. I'll take it. Sunken pirate treasure. Hitting a mithril shard. Yard. Okay, so... Aha! Way into the ship. Oh, that doesn't look good. <laughs> Holy crap! Shark. Let's just grab this crystal trident and uh, get the hell out of here, shall we? The outside of the ship we go. And now if we head out here... Holy crap, he was right in my face! So, this shark here... Uh, he, I believe he actually starts constantly appearing in this area. So I don't really think he's actually a boss, even though I'm pretty sure most people would consider him one, considering he's not a normal enemy. And I should probably cure, shouldn't I? Yeah. I'll go ahead and probably put a boss bio on screen for him anyway. Yeah. Thank you, Ariel. Jesus, this guy is doing too much damage. I am not a sushi bar. I'd love to go to a sushi bar, but I am not one myself. Just because I'm half dolphin. Thank you, Ariel. <laughs> Dumbass. Now get. Yeah, he just swam off, so. Let's head back into the calm depths now. We got what we needed, so... Let's allow ourselves to get blown into the undersea valley. 
Wait, no, I didn't want to go into the undersea valley. Ugh. Now I gotta follow the tridents again, because we need to go back to Ariel's Grotto. Yeah, there's another area of the calm depths we can go into, I think. And that leads us to where we actually need to go. Yeah, there we go. Alright, much better. So I'm going to ignore you guys. Really wish I could swim faster. Hint, hint, game. Uh, let's ignore the sheltering zone. Treasure chest there. I didn't grab. I'll grab it later. I don't feel like dealing with the sheltering zone right now. This video is getting kind of long as it is anyway. And as I said, where we need to head is Ariel's Grotto. Which coincidentally is just right outside the... Triton's Palace. I love how they have these little grottos as like home areas in... Atlantica. Well, see, fish people need a place to live, too. So anyway, that crystal trident we got? Guess where it fits? Ariel, you've disobeyed me again. Oh, boy. I told you not to leave the palace. Sebastian, you traitor. Jeez, was that necessary? Young man, you're not from another ocean. You're from another world, aren't you? Huh? Then you must be the key bearer. He's smart for an old man. How did you know? You may fool Ariel, but you can't fool me. You don't know your dorsal fin from your tail. Uh. As the key bearer, you must already know one must not meddle in the affairs of other worlds. Of course I know that, but... You have violated this principle. How? The key bearer shatters peace and brings ruin. I call oh, bullshit. Sure is not like that. I thank you for saving my daughter, but there is no room in my ocean for you or your key. What an asshole. Meanwhile... My, my. The poor child suffers such deep sorrow. What a pity. If only there was something we could do. Wait, maybe she can be of some help. Yes, maybe she can be of some help to you. Who are you talking about? Oh, she would surely help you. She'd make all your dreams come true. Ursula can help. You called, my dear? You're Ursula. Well, I was just wondering if... It's all right. Helping others is what I live for. Let me guess. You wish to see other worlds. <laughs> that shouldn't be too hard. After all, your new friends came from another world. What? But they had special help. That mysterious key. <gasps> now, now, cheer up, sweetie. You have something special, too. Huh? Now listen carefully. Bullshit. Bullshit everywhere. Bullshit as far as the eye can see. Uh, anything to add, Flounder? That's hopefully not bullshit for a change. Scared to look for her, uh, okay. 
So, I'm gonna go ahead and call this an episode because we've gone on for a while, even with the cutting I know I'm gonna have to do because of that stupid dolphin mishap. Ugh. Besides, I need to save myself from all the bullshit I've been hearing because there's way too much of it in this world. How do they keep this ocean clean? So... We managed to find a crystal trident. King Triton destroyed it and outed us for who we truly are. Not bad, old man, not bad. Ariel now knows the truth, and I highly doubt Ursula's intent is to actually help her. And as you've noticed by the fact that Donald's out here, Ariel has left our party. Which reminds me, I never actually got a chance to go over her stats or anything, so... I'll have to do that when we get her back, because she's not gone from our party forever. So, until next time, thank you guys for watching, I have been Rupt at... And next time on Let's Play Kingdom Hearts, I guess we're going to go track down Ariel and see if we can help her before Ursula helps her. I'll see you guys then.